More than 40,000 people, Palestinian people have been killed. Genocide. We're here protesting for an immediate ceasefire and an end to the genocide and the funding of the genocide and an end to the occupation. It's been more than 75 years, more than 40,000 people, Palestinian people have been killed. This needs to end right now. And this is why we're here in the rain, in the thunder, in the snow, in the sun, whatever. We're here, we're protesting, and we won't stop protesting until the genocide ends. In front of the World War II memorial, we are standing here and we are having this set in here because we have the people has to understand that the injustice is the same. If it was in the Second World War or now, it's the same thing. It's a, a, someone who is oppressing people and an oppressed people. In this situation, the Palestinians are the oppressed one, and this colonial project called Israel is the oppressor, and this has to, st has to have to be stopped. We don't have to make the mistake twice, and we say it very clear to the Dutch government, don't make the same mistake you took in the Second World War and stand on the side of the oppressed people. Uh, I fully support the students and the student intifada that they're currently holding and occupying the universities in the U.S. And I hope that we will see a movement all throughout the world where other students will follow the U.S. universities' lead and we'll see more and more of those protests because what is happening right now is absolutely not okay. Never again is now. And we're letting it happen again despite all our efforts and we're going to keep fighting.